welcome back guys so I've come out today in this glorious day beautiful it is absolutely beautiful about 14 degrees I will talk to you about this trasheroo bag that we've put onto the landy it's a great external storage bag so the bags are a trasheroo and it just clips onto the onto the rear tire with the two webbing straps and I just want to show you what a great piece of kit it is you know for your trash it's designed for your trash which I'm going to use you know on longer trips but I just like how diverse the bag is you can do a lot with it you know sometimes you've got all your wet clothes and bits and pieces you can just throw them in there instead of leaving them in your Land Rover you know in smelly fire equipment barbecues and things like that you can just chuck them in there dirty washing all your your vegetables and stuff your potatoes and that if you're going on a long trip you can all live in there so well impressed with this easy to install just a couple of straps around the tire and hey ho you got an external bag so this bag comes in several colors i chose green because i i quite like green and heavy duty canvas so it can you know live outside for a number of years without worrying about it but the thing I like about this bag is you've got external storage mesh so I can carabiner and webbing on the side so I can you know like for, say I've got a carabiner on there I've got a little temperature key ring and a little compass on there and my waterproof matches because it's predominantly going to be kind of a fire cook bag at the moment and then on this mesh I've just got a little foldable shovel on there so if you get caught short or whatever you can you can use that and then on this side which I find really useful is a is a water bottle so I've got a water bottle spare water bottle on the outside and just grab a drink or if I'm going for a walk I can just unclip that like the other day I come up I forgot my water bottle and I thought oh yeah I've got a spare one on my trasheroo bag so that's fitted with a carabiner the reason I chose this bag is because of its size there's not many rear bags that can hold this much gear inside and the obviously the external pockets like for instance you got the flap over section it's a huge pocket in there so I've got a little string hammock I've got my blow up bed inflatable mattress there for you know outside camping or if I want to sleep on the floor inside the Land Rover so that sits in there I've got a couple of small tarps in there and good old dog's bowl if you own a dog perfect place to keep it outside that's, that's quite a good one that because it's collapsible so it's perfect you know you just pull off and you want to give your dog a drink you have to go rooting all through the inside it's it's all outside so there are all my bits in there and it can still you know that flap there can still hold a lot more kit So I do love the size of the trasher roof. So there's a couple of really strong buckles on the outside, fully adjustable. So that lifts up like that. And then I've, with the webbing, I've clipped up on a little pouch. So like I said, it's predominantly for a sort of fire lighting and bits and pieces. So I've got a fire glove and fire lighters nice ease of use just light that with a lighter bang you got yourself a fire you not got to spend too much time making fire so that sits on there but you can with all this webbing you can attach loads of kit on here 
it's endless, you know, axes, knives. You know, and they all sit sit in the mesh. So that's great, but I'm gonna, you know, depend on the trips, mix and match, but it's great, you know, your smelly, dirty clothes, your, your rubbish can all live in there, your wet clothes all live in there. So inside the bag's real generous size bag, you know, you can see how big it is. And then inside here, got a nice bit of firewood. You know I like my fires. I think the Land Rover and making a nice fire and having a cook up somewhere is, is definitely the way to go. So they're in there. And I've got one of these easy start fire logs again in there like the paper bag instant fire and then the Kelly kettle which is a must I think if you own a Land Rover you've got to own a Kelly kettle I think they go hand in hand you know the beauty of a Land Rover is you you can use the inside but predominantly you are outside that's why they're such a great vehicle you don't want to be sitting inside the Land Rover all the time, you want to be outside. You know, the thing with camper vans and caravans, they're so comfortable inside with all the facilities, you, you never go outside. So, that that is a great piece of kit to, to accompany the Land Rover for making brews. So it's waterproof lining inside. You can get so much kit in there, you know, you can see what I've just pulled out of it and that's hardly taken up any room inside that bag so all that would be living inside the landy so it just utilises that outside space and obviously you can take double that in that bag I've hardly filled it up what I like to do sometimes when I'm on a trip if someone has left a load of rubbish you just stick a full size uh, rubbish bag in there and just do your bit for the environment pick up someone's rubbish it doesn't doesn't cost you any time or money and it just cleans up the environment if everyone done it then you know these beautiful spots that people have trashed it's, it's clean for the next person so I tend to do that and that's one of the the reasons I you know I got this trash bag but like I said easy to install and even at the bottom of the bag there's a little drain drain plug just there so any wet items it's gonna drain out but you know it's a wet day you got your waterproofs on just chuck them in there and they'll dry drain off there and then you can dry them out so brilliant as you can see the how the bag clips on just a couple of buckles that go around the tire you just cross them over and then a strap at the top just secures it I did have a wheel cover on but I had to take it off because it was just slipping around too much. But like I said, a great piece of kit for the Land Rover. It's like a bottomless, bottomless cavern, that bag. And I've had this on here since I've got it. I've probably had it on, put this bag on. It's probably a couple of months, so it's been in all that snow and rain. And you know all the things inside are, are nice and dry. And it dries really quick, especially if you're on the road travelling as well. Like I said, if you're in the market for a a nice external bag, it's great. You you know you're always looking for external storage, and this is this is a great addition. I've seen the bonnet storage as well. That looks pretty good, but pretty sold on this. That's all packed away. So great, great bag, love it. And one final feature with the bag, you can take this off and if you did need a rucksack, you got yourself a, a very large rucksack to go go off and get your timber or whatever you want to get. And uh, it's on the back of the van, practical. Hope this has been helpful. I've put this video out because 
I was looking for a bag myself and uh, there's a couple of good trasheroo videos on the internet but nothing you know you could really get your teeth into and you know have a good look at so hopefully I've, I've shown the bag quite well and you can see the scale of it and obviously see what you can you can carry in it and you know it's 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 a well built bag and it's going to take a lot lot of punishment and a lot of load so thanks for watching guys and look at the weather gorgeous gorgeous weather so won't be long now we're almost on the right side of, of the lockdown and I think everyone's like purring their Land Rover engines and doing bits and pieces to them going through the motions playing inside and then it's all gonna go everyone's gonna be hitting the road and doing what they love doing so won't be long now so thanks for watching guys and see you on the next one thanks for all your support the channels channels doing really well really loving the uh, doing the overlanding videos and won't be long for on our first trip so cheers guys enjoy the great outdoors